Oh, no, no, no. I just asked if you. Yeah. Cafe in Ottawa. This is awesome. So cute. It's all vegan here too. So you know how we are about the vegan foods and drinks and all that. So we're pumped. And then you got beautiful cats who are just like, they all have their own personality and they're all so cute. And some are funny, some are mean. Okay. <laughs> with your wife. You gotta eat faster, man. Nope. Oh. You flushed it out. Oh, she's got that. Nope, nope. No, no, no. No, no, no. No, no, no. No, no, no. I'm taking it away, guys. Mm. Nice try. <laughs> no. Wow. We're just leaving the cat cafe now. That was amazing. We're here for three more days. And I'm pretty sure if Tina's down. Um, I think we're gonna be there for the next three days. Like, yeah. <laughs> breakfast is already decided. Every single day, we're gonna go to this feline cafe. Oh, Not for only sure. is it vegan, but it takes care of like so many rescued cats. And I think that's like what I wanna support. It's oh, like, for that's, sure. that's the amazing thing is like they're just they're taking care of these beautiful cats and need, need a home. And yeah, like we could go to a restaurant that like has vegan options, but at the same time, like you're still contributing to a restaurant that's contributing to an industry that kills animals. And exactly. no thanks, I'd rather go to this place. We've got vegan foods and there's rescuing cats. So it's like the Come best on. of every world. You know, We're pumped. It. Ottawa, thank sure. you. If you plan on going to Ottawa, and you are vegan, even if you're not and you just love cats, go to this place, check it out. It's great therapy for yourself and the cats. Tina's being illegal. It's on top of this fountain you're not supposed to be. Come on, Tina. Tina, you're doing it wrong. What? Who said that? Right now we're sitting in this garden that was made by uh, Zen monks and it's basically meant to be a place for meditation. So we're just here kind of meditating, kind of just taking pictures for Instagram, but... I'm meditating! <laughs> she loves it. I love her. So far so dope. Auto has been pretty cool. Pretty, uh, I mean this is only day one, but it's a nice energy about this place. Compared to Montreal also, it's a lot less busy, less crowded, less people which gives us more room to fuck around, so ha <laughs> <laughs> Seriously though, Ottawa, you're actually beautiful, yo. Oh, fucking shit! I'm falling! I'm fuck just like Tina. Can't skateboard. For shit. Don't do that, Brennan. 
Yo, we were at the mall and I just had to comment on this. Like, I really, I just look like a tourist. Got my umbrella, camera, touring. Um, I'm making food because Ottawa's not that good for vegan options. Sorry. We're out for a night on the a day day on the town, but uh, da da da, it's raining. It's raining. But thankfully, our urban b b b b lady had an umbrella for us, so that's dope. Anyway, we picked up some food from the metro. It's in my backpack, and we're gonna go back to the urban b for a Netflix and chill type night. And I don't know, we'll see how it goes. But on these rainy days, there's really not too, 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 too much we could do, so. That's Tina. That's the capital of Canada. No, it's not. Wait, no, that's the capital of Canada? Oh, man. I should have paid attention to school, man. What's over there? Oh, man. Rain! Rain! <laughs> Sometimes I just say and make the, the most random noises in the camera and I apologize for that But at the same time, it's like a sorry not sorry type situation because I am who I am. Ottawa's been pretty nice so far <laughs> This is beautiful. Yeah, back at the urban boo. Hippie mode activated the shirts off. What up? Tina's working on the foods. Oh, look at my girl. She's so good in the kitchen So good in the kitchen. She is. She's a beast in the kitchen. Hey, well, I learned from the best. Aw, Tina's done cooking and she set up this cute little spot for us to eat foods. Netflix and chill. Netflix and chill. What'd you make, babe? A weird pesto scramble, I guess you could call it. It has like arugula, gnocchi with pesto, uh, gusta, Montreal smoked vegan sausage, cheese, lots of avocado. Did I say that already? Probably because. So much avocado. Tell them that she's are vegan because everybody needs to know I'm vegan. Because I'm vegan and I'm vegan and it means I'm better than you because I'm vegan.